So this was your garage here? Yes. Jacinia Lopez looks at what's left of her townhome she just rented four months ago. She moved here to have more space for her five children, ages 7 to 14. They were all home on February 18th on a Sunday afternoon when her sister first smelled the smoke. I just seen the whole garage in flames. Um, we were just screaming and yelling to get the kids off the house and the kids ran out. Montgomery County fire officials say the fire on Treasure Oak Court was accidental, electrical in nature. It started at an outlet in the garage and spread. The kids ran out. They didn't have any shoes on, short. They had shorts on. It was very cold the day of the incident. But, you know, I'm glad that everyone made it out safely and no life were lost. Lopez says all of her photo albums of the children were lost in the fire. She and the kids who were in elementary and middle school are thankful for all the help they've received from the Tower Oak community. They're starting over from scratch. We currently just need um, support overall, um, clothing, shoes, um, any financial assistance will help and just trying to see if we can find a new home. She says her insurance is covering their hotel room through Saturday. They're desperately looking for housing, hoping to stay in this community. Start rebuilding everything, even the loss of the vehicles that I had lost. I lost two vehicles um, and two motorcycles. So I am just, just want to rebuild, take things slowly, and just go back to the happy life that we were living before the loss. Darcy Spencer, News 4. The family has set up a donation site to help them get back on their feet.